For Yuri Rodionov, the second tournament this year was already a good step forward. We are, of course, very satisfied with the victory in a challenger for the moment. Enjoying the moment is important, but it is only a moment and the work should continue with self-confidence as a tailwind. Our cooperation started two months ago and I am delighted with the development so far. At the beginning of our work, Yuri was very insecure and lost when it came to his tennis. My first task was to give him a basic concept that would allow him to find his game again. When Yuri embodies the necessary calmness on the court, he can play to his strengths. I think we have succeeded on that for the time being. The next part will be more difficult as it involves working step by steps on the things that cause Yuri difficulties in the match. From my point of view, the timing is therefore important as to when, which aspects can be worked on. From Yuri's side, the willingness to implement it is required. You can't say that Yuri is an easy guy, but special types usually have more room for improvement if you manage to guide them in the right direction. But that involves leading and being led, which is the next important task. Unfortunately, Yuri bruised his big toe in the final due to a hot heated action. As a result, hardly any training was possible this week. We will see if he will be ready for the next tournament. Another surprise for me was the call from Matej Dodik, an 18-year-old Croatian player with great potential asked if he could reintegrate into our group. We spent a few weeks together last summer and they were quite successful. He won two of his three future titles during this time. However, he then received a financially attractive offer from Switzerland and decided to take a different path. However, he was not so satisfied with the coaching solutions afterwards and remembered our good cooperation. Our doors were of course open to him. We value not only his tennis skills but also his character and together with Sebastian Sorger we would have two players of the same age with great potential who could push each other. It was the last week of the preseason for Sebastian Sorga and Nico Jäger. Together with Mate Dodik, we are now planning future tournaments in Tunisia. I'm happy with the progress we've made in recent weeks. Now it's time to put what we've learned into competition. The first few weeks of the year were a very intense time for my partner Ivan Galic and me. At the same time we also enjoyed the energy on the court with our players. With the start of the tournaments good planning is again required on our part. So it won't get boring for us. Now we will see how the start of the competition goes. I hope to see you in the next video.